This one looks cool. This one came out two weeks ago. We're going to raw dog it and uh, see what happens, okay? Well, it starts off with Amy Celebrity Crushes Joe Rogan. <laughs> oh, jeez. He does have some killer nipples. Amy's celebrity crush is Joe Rogan. Yeah, you really yeah. like him? Yeah, I don't know why. He was like, uh, oh, oh, you, you like him? That's a little, uh, that's a little. Amy's celebrity crush is Joe Rogan. Yeah, you really yeah. like him? Yeah, I don't know why. Like I think it's the like testosterone. <laughs> Welcome. The most delicate little button press too. Hey, he looks nothing like Joe Rogan. I'm surprised she didn't slap that button. Was he exuding a lot of testosterone? testosterone. <laughs> I mean, I guess. He's a liar. No, he's a beta male. Only alpha, oh, only alpha omega males like Joe Rogan. Beta males do not. Come Welcome on. to Donnie. Nice to meet you. Fun fact about Donnie, he's a Marvel nerd. Are you into Marvel? You know what? No. Like my brother watches them, but- Oh, I that draw, he's done. He, did you see that? As soon as she said no, it's Marvel? gone. It was you know gone. What? No. Like my brother watches them, but I just can't get into anime. Like anime? <laughs> like you can't not like Marvel. It's amazing. It's amazing. There's Tell so it. many different things and it's not anime. My it's just like a bunch of superheroes who try to save everybody. Yeah, my boy Donnie likes Marvel, okay? And don't disrespect my boy Donnie with the energy of I don't like anime. Bitch, Marvel and anime are completely different, okay? And if you can't tell the difference, I'd press that button fast as hell, too. I don't even like Marvel or anime. But if you don't have the common sense to know the difference between them, Lordy Jenkins, I'm pressing that shit. Donnie? Yeah, I'll give it a chance, okay. maybe. <laughs> it's nice yeah. to meet you. Nice to meet you. Donnie's like, You're next. You have to like Marvel films, right? Uh, the comics, the movies, it's just, uh, my, I have a dog named Marvel, so it's kind of a... Donnie knows what he me. likes. Uh, Donnie yeah, knows yeah, what he yeah, wants, yeah, and he's not Marvel. messing around. <laughs> Hi. Are they laughing at him because he likes Marvel? Oh, hell nah. Equal rights and equal lefts coming out. Donnie, no one's making fun of my boy. <laughs> nah, 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 because the laughing, like they're all so cool. Listen, okay. I may be too invested into this, but I'm feeling for my boy Donnie and it's, it's, it's making me angry. It's making me angry. Hi, I'm Donnie. Hopefully yeah. you find someone nice to better. Nice to meet you. So tell me about you. What do you do? I uh, grew up in California, moved here six years ago. I have a fun fact. There's no way she just put her hand up to press uh, the button. Grew up in California, Look! Moved here six years ago. I have a fun fact about Mia. Oh, God. She was a competitive figure skater for 10 years. What? Yeah. I live near a rink that still produces Olympians every year. That's she went to crazy. press that yeah. button. I gave up about halfway through, though, because I was like, I don't want to do it, and I kind of just switched to like Disney on Ice type of shows. Okay. Donnie is a big Marvel nerd. Are you into Marvel? I made the effort to sit down and do all the Marvel movies, and I think I stopped after like the second one in order, just because it felt like too much of a task. <laughs> like I couldn't commit to that. Whole oh, he ain't laughing. Oh, that was he did not find any of that funny. By the way, what he what you may have seen was a laugh on the inside. No whole timeline. That is not how favorite he Marvel movie character anything like that. Spider Man. <laughs> You're absolutely lovely. No, oh no, worries. was it Spider-Man? I just didn't get the initial spark. That was really yeah, it. That's, that's fair. Such a pleasure to I like Spider-Man too. To Donnie, if you want to go out on a second date, I'm down. Look at <laughs> Look at all them cheering and stuff, bro. Oh my god. Oh my God, the energy, just those group of guys were way nicer than the group. I mean, again, we only saw 10 seconds each, but oh, I like Marvel, hey! And then everyone else, he likes Marvel. <laughs> they making fun of him, bro. All right, we'll see though, we'll see. Maybe maybe some more truer colors will be shown here, but I'm gonna say, in this episode, the boys' room's given, given better energy this time. Oh, the men for are sure, very for sure. excited that I rejected him, apparently. <laughs> I'm done. I mean, no, nice they're excited you. that they got yeah. the wolf nice back in the you. pack, so okay? Like to I love going out and like exploring, trying to find out new places and things like that, but like 90% of the time I'm at home knitting with my dog. Mm, I love dogs. I have a dog myself. Oh, what type of dog do you have? Uh, he's like a mini golden doodle, so he's like, oh, yeah, very fluffy, like looks exactly like a teddy bear. Doodles are so cute. Yeah. I love doodles. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's all right. You're I mean, he didn't cut her off, at least he waited. That was kind of nice. Your type? Uh, probably like Asian girls. Totally um, fine. Yeah. Oh, why do you have a racial preference? <laughs> I think there's just like that cultural disconnect that's kind of hard to get over. Totally valid. Uh -huh. Lovely to meet yeah, you. Sorry. No, you're great. You know, I usually think that racial preferences are kind of weird to me. You know, especially when you say, like, there's a specific one that you don't like. That's usually when it's like really weird to me. 
But if it's within your own race and then you have the whole cultural thing behind it, I can kind of see that. But I feel like me, I would date outside of my culture. I feel like I would not want to date a Middle Eastern girl because it would feel like my cousin. I don't know. I mean, maybe that's just... Maybe that's just me. You always dress like this? Um, I do cosplay often. Mm. Um, it's like I've been doing it. You know, coming into the speed dating show in a cosplay <laughs> takes fucking confidence, bro. Because I'm not showing up dressed as Ghostface or Leon. What the fuck? She, I, I don't know how. Dude, that's a lot of confidence to and show yours. up like that. Is cosplay a little bit of a sex thing? It's not something, a sex thing for me. Hey, I've it's not a sex thing. I've never done it cosplay before, but it is a very popular thing. Yeah. Because people are like, I want to fuck my favorite character. Yeah, I think it's just like, you know, like role playing, like living out kind of like a, a little exactly. fantasy type of thing. Exactly. Why did you press the button? Um, I'm just asking. Not, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. Sure, thank yeah. you. Asking. Hi. Hi, what's your name? I'm um, Christy, how about you? Christy? I wouldn't I'm ask. Nice to meet you. So, what do you do for fun? Ignorance I is love bliss. Sports, mm -hmm. basketball. Volleyball, tennis are like the three that I mainly play. Okay. Um, but I'll play anything. It's cause, uh, oh. sorry. <laughs> no worries. Uh, yeah, why'd you press it? I feel like we have like good like friend vibes, but I'm not like necessarily like attracted in like yeah. that way. Sorry. No, I respect that. I respect yeah, okay. That. Nice, nice to meet you, meet you though. Yeah, nice, nice to meet you. you. He got friend zoned in five seconds? Whoa. Friend vibes in five seconds? No. No, I have to study this clip because I need to make sure to not do whatever homeboy did. Okay. Write this down, everyone. Write this down. Uh, what did he do? Is she not liking the uh, hand gestures? Uh, sorry. <laughs> Too much smiling? Uh, yeah, why'd you press it? I feel like we have, like, good, like, Too much vibes, of a soft voice? I'm not, like, necessarily, like, attracted in, like, yeah. that way. Sorry. No, I respect that. I respect yeah, okay. That. Nice, nice to meet you, though. Yeah, nice, nice to meet you. you. Oh, that's too bad. I'm not a big sports fan, though, so when you're mm, like, listening all that, okay, like, I'm sorry, okay, I'm, so like, the sports. I'm not there. <laughs> okay. I pressed it twice. So if I ever talk to someone, I'm not sharing any of my interests. I'm just going to be very bland and reflective. What do you like? Dogs? Me too. Cats? Me too. You hate them? Me too. I'm just going to. No personality. Okay? You knocked out too, huh? Yeah, knocked out too. Okay, <laughs> why is it like a competition? You got them? Good. Good. You knocked out three of them? Good job. Why are they... How have you been feeling? I'm kind of nervous. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but my lip is quivering because I can't, like, contain. So I they're drinking White Claws nervous. in the back, too, so they're nice a little tipsy. You, Christy. Uh, I'm Alfred. Um, so what do you like to do for fun? Uh, like to hike, longboard, anything outdoors. Mm. Like to surf, I'm from California, so. Okay, those are close to sports, buddy. She might click you, be careful. But maybe not enough sports. Ah, she's kind of waiting for the button. Is surfing a sport? It is to her. Get the me. hell out. Oh. He beat me? Okay. Sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Sorry, really you get the hell out. No, that's I'm sorry. Yeah, it's okay, it's okay. Have a good yeah. one. Damn, she does not like anything physical it's activity. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> nothing. Hi. If it gives you if it gives you any sort of sports vibes, Amy's she's out. Celebrity crash is Joe Rogan. This is the one I want to watch. Yeah, you like him? Yeah, I don't know why. Like I think it's the testosterone. Like I mean, I guess. <laughs> He's a lot. Yeah. He's a lot? <laughs> yeah. I feel so bad. Oh my. Why'd you press what? the shit? <laughs> she came out with the. I'm so sorry. She came out with the Joe Rogan. What do you mean, why'd you press the button? Girl, come on. We got to work on that a little bit. Let's not share that to everybody. How about that? Hey, why'd Anna. you press the I'm button? Alfred. Nice to meet you, Anna. Nice to meet you. Alfred wants a lot of kids. You want a lot of kids? Like, how many kids? I don't know what a lot of kids is. <laughs> um, I want, like, four eventually. Like, that's kind of a lot. Damn, that is a lot. A lot. Kids, no. Like, not at all? No. Oh, so shit. <laughs> he is on how a kill streak right now. He's about to get a UAV. That's a lot of work. I mean, yeah, I mean. What's your dating Bro is on a kill streak. Oh, well, I'm 36. 36. I would say, like, 28 to 28. 40. What's yours? <laughs> Am I an old lady? Yes. I'm an old lady. I'm sorry. <laughs> I feel like a really bad person. That's why I could never do this, bro. No offense, but if I was a, if there was somebody on the button and they were 36 years old, I'd probably press it too because they're 36 years old and I'm not 36 years old, but I would still feel awful. I would still feel like a piece of shit. Uh, it's tough out, bro. I could never do this. I think I would just allow... Everybody to press it on me. 
I'm going to go there, do my thing. If they don't want to press it, let's go grab lunch. And if they do press it, then I'm going to go in the back and chug a couple White Claws. All right, I start taking off my shirt and dancing on the table. What are you looking for in a partner? Um, I'm looking for someone who can talk to me. Yeah. Someone who could be real. Yeah. You know, someone who likes adventure and not just stay in, even though I do like staying in sometimes, but... <laughs> I'm sorry. Just my brother is wiping out the I'm lobby. Sorry. What, what is my brother type? is wiping out the lobbies. You don't date outside of Latinas? That seemed cringy. That is not what I meant. Shit. They're going to think I'm an asshole. Look, look, look. Okay, okay, but I get this though. I get the whole like if it's the same guy, if he's over here, you know, wiping out the lobby. The next person's got to bring him back. And I kind of like the aspect of that. It's kind of funny. I'm good. How are you, Laura? Oh, first. Look, because she's not, because right now, her idea, the girls are waiting. They're watching. I don't care what he says. He can tell me that I'm the most beautiful girl in the world and he's going to take me to Paris tonight. I'm pressing this button. Watch. She's not going to be there, bro. She's thinking about the button. Alfred has rejected a lot of women. Um, I have heard. Let's get right to the point. Oh, look. What's she's bloodthirsty. I'm looking for someone who knows who they want in life. Someone who's... Wait a second. Last second, it was Latinas. Why we... Ch <laughs> Hold on. You just said Latinas 30 seconds ago. That's not what they say. Your type. Come on. Confident. Independent. <laughs> Why are you changing the answer? Something else. Yeah, Latina. Yeah, okay. make sure you come out with that energy. <laughs> I like a man who has his shit together. Held. The most, the most basic answer. I like a man. She didn't. She wasn't thinking of a real answer. She's <laughs> pressing him, bro. I mean, I'm Latina. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, you press that fucking button. I'm Laura, sorry. You know what I would like to see. A girl go in, you know, and, you know, and with all the girls backing her up, press the button, press the button. But then she low key falls for the guy, and she's like, and she doesn't press it. That would be kind of funny. And then they go back, and they're like, "What the fuck? You're supposed to press him." Come on, that would be kind of hilarious. A little bit. Oh, nice. Uh, how's your experience been? Good. I, I mean, this is my first time doing this, but the girls... he seems a little disinterested. Oh, that's a good question. How was that? How was walking into a sorority of women, all juiced up on whatever you know? Hormones are being released. Wait, what did he just co wait? What did he just come out with saying? Did he just say like the women are just filled with hormones? Wait, what? What did he say? Wait, hold on. I'm gonna turn the captions on. What did he say? Oh, that's a good question. How <laughs> was that? How was walking into a sorority of women, all juiced up on whatever you know? Hormones are being released. Uh, back there, it's testosterone. I'm not sure what what is the. I guess the... estrogen would uh -huh. be. It. Right, right. I mean, honestly, the girls are amazing. Oh. I. And how did you establish yourself in the hierarchy? What the fuck is he saying? I'm just <laughs> what, 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 what kind of not? Like that's just like inherent, like human yeah. dynamic. I mean, I don't know. Okay, so let's get the Joe Rogan fan back out here because we found the Andrew Tate fan. Let's make sure we get them together because I already know the match. Why are we Why are we playing Cupid here? I got it going. Let's get the Joe Rogan girl back and leave uh, Andrew Tate homeboy out here. No, I'm a friendly person and I'm really you seem honest. Like that. Yeah, same I told thing you guys you. he seemed disinterested, bro. He's 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 an alpha omega chat. He seemed just like super down to earth. Laura, oh, down to earth. I was thinking omega chat. Shopping addiction. <laughs> To kind of clean that up, I'm a wardrobe stylist. So I'm always on the lookout for shopping and for things. Okay, and so I it buy... sounds productive. Jesse. What? Is addicted to nicotine patches. Well, so people don't know nicotine is a neurotropic. Um, so hey, what? Is something that helps. Uh, Why is that your, your fun fact for him? Um, um, yeah. Jesse, so you know, he's I got a crippling addiction to, to cigarettes. For too long for me. Interesting. Yeah. What do you do for work? Run a company. Oh, so you have a lot more freedom. Or Run a company. Okay, I'm going to tell y'all. Eh, listen, all my viewers out there, if you go to a man and you ask him what his job is and his answer is run a company, I'm telling you guys, I don't care. I don't care how many green flags. That is the biggest threat. I run a company. Okay, Jeff Bezos, where's your Lamborghini then, Mr. I run a company? Where you can. All right. Do you find each other attractive? I do find you attractive. I find you attractive too. You think you want to go on a second date? He's confident I mean, though. You see the eye contact? Day. Hey, listen. No Maybe right, the I'm Andrew Tate School of. <laughs> Maybe Hustlers University. <laughs> there is no way, bro. This was the. I didn't expect these two. One more time. And if you don't press me, you will win the button. I didn't expect these date. two. So. Kind of looks like Markiplier a little bit. I kind of get like Markiplier vibes. 
Sorry, sorry, sorry. I what? think I, I had to, I had the second I had the second guess. You said you're going to second. I, I, I certainly I certainly uh, would. Yeah, I think I, I would. I think you're great. Um, but I, but you just rejected her. Yeah, I went with my gut. Yeah. Okay. Run a company. It's a heuristic I have. It's so it has to be a very strong, overwhelming. Yes. Otherwise, I catch myself, and then I, I'll default to no. I'm an insane person. Not necessarily I a bad I, thing. That was the right choice that he made, to be honest. All right. Thank you. Not necessarily a bad thing. He's con he wants to be confident in his decisions. This guy definitely goes to his barber, and if he doesn't like the haircut, he lets his barber know. I do not like this cut. That's the kind of things I can't do. I can't do that. Yikes. So. It's, the, it's that Andrew Tate Alpha Sigma oh, male no. energy. Game time, body, functions. I just, I feel so bad. She was so sweet. But that's the nature of the, the beast, I suppose. The nature of the beast? Why do you talk like that? Why are you asking her who established the, uh, the patriarchal, <laughs> the patriotic hi hierarchy earlier? Like, what? why do you talk like this? Okay, listen, some people talk differently. Maybe I'm just upset. Maybe I feel like it's threatening my intelligence. He's so smart. If there's one thing about the button, it's I know that deep down, it will never be boring. It will be interesting. It doesn't matter what kind of episode we get. Two human beings on a speed dating show in which one of them needs to press a button to reject the other one will never not be interesting. 